okay, girls? If there was ever a time to just be yourself, this is it right now, okay? There's a little piece of advice for me there. Easier said than done with the nerves. It is. Now, prior to the show, we asked all 51 states to make up a final question. Moments ago, we pulled the questions written by the top five and the current Miss Teen USA. So the girls will actually be answering a question posed by a contestant standing right here on this very stage. That's kind of cool. All right, you'll only have 30 seconds to answer before you hear this bell. Now, good luck, and let's begin with Nevada. Hello. Hello, Nevada. we we'll reach in. All right, this question comes from Hawaii. What book has most influenced your life and why? I'm going to have to say The Great Gatsby because he lived a life of just hiding his true self. He tried to make people love him for who he wasn't. And he went out and tried to, you know, buy expensive cars and clothes and, you know, trying to make people love him. But really inside, he should love himself because each and one of us loves ourselves inside as well. And then it will spill over to everybody else and you'll see your true self and everybody will see you as well. Thank you, Nevada. Nevada. Up next, Louisiana. Hello. Thank you. This question comes from Tennessee. Do you think your future will be determined more by choice, chance, or destiny? I think my future, and as well as everyone else's future, is determined by choice, definitely. Um, the only way to see where you're going is to make the right decisions, and you know, if, if you make the right decisions, that's where you're gonna go. If you make pathetic decisions, you know, you're never gonna get anywhere. So I think choice is definitely over anything. Thank you, Louisiana. All right, Maryland. Reach in. Thank you very much. Now this one comes from Louisiana. She asks, what do you think is a teenager's greatest weakness or temptation? Hmm. Well, today teenagers are the, the most weakness is peer pressure with all the other teenagers in their school and community. And you just have to look up to your parents and the morals you've been raised up with to pull fast all this. All right, thank you, Marilyn. Up next, Hawaii. Hello. This question comes from the reigning Miss Teen USA 2003, Tammy Farrell. This year is election year. What would be the first thing you would do if you were elected president? First thing I would do is probably work with the FDA and try to ban all the fast food restaurants because I think it's really hurting some of the people out here because I'm so addicted to french fries. <laughs> There's something in them, I bet. Thank you, Hawaii. Tennessee. Alrighty then. This one comes from Maryland. Is technology taking away children's ability to be more creative? Oh goodness. You know, no, I don't really think so. Because, you know, I have a little nine-year-old brother. And, you know, he's all into those video games and everything. And some of those games, you know, they do have bad, you know, expectations and stuff. But others, they can teach, you know, the children stuff. So, you know, I would... Actually, just no, I don't think they would. All right, well, thank you, Tennessee. Thank you, Tennessee. Excellent job, everybody. Well done. Good job, ladies. Well, a big year is coming up for one of them, but just when you thought the title Miss Team USA would be enough, I uh, think again. Whoever wins will also walk away with a package of prizes and opportunities that are completely insane. insane.